So after yesterday's little funny video that we just put out with the immense bugs that was currently in the game, I've decided to try to make a bit of another video here. I want to try to help you with as much as I know about the geese and how to hunt them this far. Now if you have the DLC, you have access to these which are some new blinds. You can actually hide in them. You don't need them because you actually do get the same amount of cover if you're just hiding in plain sight being prone. And as soon as you try to acquire aim from one of those, you will scare away any geese close. Now you also have the 20 gauge, which is this shotgun. And I really did not like it with bird shots in it. But for some reason, you can actually shoot the Canada goose with buck shots. And that makes it an insane weapon to use on the Canada Goose and I would highly advise you to try it out with the box shots before you put this in the cabin. Also if you are on the discord you know about the spreadsheet but if you're not join the discord there's a link down below and check out the spreadsheet because we will have it updated with all the weapons that you can use to shoot the goose. I really like that saying, but I'm pretty sure you get full integrity even with the 223 and the 357 as well. Now coming to the decoys, you can have up to, I think it's 100 decoys on the map, but once you reach 20 in a set area, and they have an attraction radius of 500 meters. So once you reach 20 in an area, you have what is called the full spread, which will pretty much just be, if you place any more, it's just going to be for looks. And if you have performance issues, take a few of them away and just have 20. You don't need to have 80 in the same location. It shouldn't really matter too much. Now, I'm not a big fan of the ground blinds and I would really love to have some geese coming in here just so I could show you that it actually works what I'm trying to tell you here. But what you want to do is you want to just be prone and you check your little line down in the right hand corner to see if you have the line which means you are somewhat hidden and this is the same line as you would have if you were hiding in one of the blinds now with these keys coming down i really want to take one down with the 223 to confirm that we actually do get full integrity and take just a few of them down with the 20 gauge with box shots just to show you how effective it actually is it is a powerhouse Actually, we're gonna do like this. Just shoot this one over here. Just check if any of them actually is any decent. That'll work. That's dead. Oh, making mistakes. I think we got two geese with the back shot there. And that one went down as well. Other than that, the best place to place your decoys does seem to be in the straw fields and the corn fields of, well, here's Felton, because it's the, right here they are. But pay attention here, it is the 20 gauge with box shots, and I do get full integrity with that. And that makes this little gun so powerful. I actually didn't even try it with the Cacciatore, just because this gun is just so much fun. It's so fast to reload, and you can easily take down quite a few. Let's see if we can find the one we shot with the 223, just to confirm. Because if we can shoot it with the 223, we should be able to shoot it with the 357 as well. Yep, full integrity with this one too. Huh. And once again, if you don't know, right click your kill screen and you will have a picture of the goose. Got another one right here. That's a small one. Liver and stomach. Just one pellet seemed to be hitting it. From the box shot. And did we have another one go down over here? This is still one of the things that I'm having some issues with. They are not highlighting once they're shot dead. I know this is a short video, but I just wanted to show you some of the things that has really made it so much easier to hunt the goose. And especially the 20 gauge with the box shot seems to be the real deal to go for with this. Thank you so much for watching and see you in the next one.